Guys, welcome back to the Modern Nomads. It's your boy Prophet. I'm Gordy. It's your boy AJ. We're back for The Walking Dead, man. Looking forward to this episode. Um, the ending of the last episode, bro. <laughs> Lori. Yo. You think she's gonna actually get? The, I think she's gonna give birth in the apocalypse, man. That's crazy. That's crazy. Like I, I thought it was Plan B, but nah, yeah. she's fully pregnant, yeah, bro. And there's pregnant. nothing you can do in this no, world, no, in no, the no, situation they're in right now. You hear me? Yeah, that's crazy. No, she's gonna, especially now that she got him to stay. Shane, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like she literally told him to stay. She didn't. She was remember. She was already um, questioning, like questioning when. Well, obviously she wasn't herself fully because yeah. her kid was like 100 percent like but she, like she said it might be better off if he wasn't even if he doesn't even make it basically. i feel like she would be even more guilty if he passed away and she had this kid no but, but that's what i mean is like mm. would she even want to bring a kid into this yeah. world because you know remember what she was saying about it, her, uh, it's God. not like she can get an abortion now even there's no literally no doctors at all yeah, yeah exactly so there's nothing really with they can do at all it's gonna be hard, man. Um, nah. Little girl, though. What the hell, bro? I, I told these episodes ago, bro. I'm off that. <laughs> I'm fully off that, man. Yo, the whole storyline. I'm off that, she bro. She's dead if she, no one has found her. Yeah. Unless someone has kept her somewhere safe, she's dead, bro. Yeah. Looking forward to this episode, um, though. Yeah. Uh, see, we get straight into this video. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, like the video. But yeah, yeah. Let's get straight into this. Let's go. I assume this is what. Okay. Isn't this where they are? At? Yeah. I know, Carl, we all are. Now, why don't I get him something to eat? I sure appreciate it. No trouble. What the hell did you tell her that for? We don't even know these damn people. How long do you think this stuff's gonna last if you keep running down? Wow. I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking. To be fair, he's speaking facts there. <laughs> I, wouldn't, I wouldn't really... Yeah, of course you would agree with a wife beer. That's profit for you. Like, you shouldn't tell people that you have food, especially in this type of scenario. I don't know how much information they have, in regards to the zombies, but Shane has seen zombies at this point since they ran away. So there's gonna be obviously food stories. That's the last person you want to really tell that you have food, because he's willing to do anything. You know, this reminds you of the beginning of uh, The Last of Us. Oh yeah, that as well. But The Last of Us, the military killed people. Like bro, if something like this happened. Oh, in this is Atlanta, wasn't it? Oh. Bro, imagine if there's people still in there. There it was. Everyone's getting new search grids today. If she made it as far as the farmhouse, Daryl found she might have gone further east than we've been so far. About what Daryl found, screaming Sophia to me. Anyone could have been holed up in that farmhouse. Oh, whoever slept in the covers, no bigger than yay high. Good lead. Maybe we'll pick up our trail again. Maybe you'll see your chupacabra up there too. Chupacabra? So you believe in a blood sucking dog? You believe dead people walking around? True. If you see zombies, I'd be inclined to believe anything. You know, we uh, still have 11 condoms. <laughs> I see 11 condoms, I see 11 minutes of my life, I'm never getting back. God damn. I don't even know if I like you. But you're thinking about it. You should. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to raise. <laughs> I know you, Shane, well enough to know that there is only one surefire way of engaging you in a conversation. And that is to start asking you about girls you did in high school. I don't want to, but I'm willing to do it if that's what it takes. Mary Ann, I told you about her. Oh, in excruciating detail. I used to live for those details back in the day. Yeah, I, I was impressionable. I was an artist in his prime. Protégé. You mean prodigy? Maybe. Prodigy, what you call young high school stud, banks 30-year-olds on the regular? Hmm? What 30-year-old were you banging in? <laughs> <laughs> PE teacher? Hey, yo. <laughs> the girl's volleyball coach? <laughs> Wasn't she married? Oh, come on. We're talking about your high school love life then, huh? That's a short conversation. It may even already be over. Isn't that right? So, Sheila, that's the one you lied to me about. I never lied about Sheila. I just got mixed up about what the bases mean. <laughs> I would just say, you know, a home run, that usually means sexual. Like, <clears throat> like that's intercourse. Yeah, you know I, I realize that now. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't be talking about this stuff. That life is it's gone, man. Everyone in it. It's like we're old folk. All the people in our stories are all dead. We, it's hard enough accepting what's happened without digging up the past. That nostalgia, like a drug. It keeps you from seeing things the way they are, and that's a danger you got people depending on. He's speaking Fox right now, bro. What are we doing? Got every able body at your disposal out scouring these woods for a little girl with both nose likely dead. He's speaking 100% facts right now, man. 
What if she's alive then? Sometimes it's not giving hope. Giving hope is the only hope you can have. Until you find the body. You honestly think we're just going to find Sophia alive? Are you that sure we won't? Alive or not, Sophia, she only matters to the degree in which she don't drag the rest of us down. That's the world that they're moving into, sadly. Bro, this is why I respect Shane, bro. Shane, Shane evolved to the new world, bro. All these the other people is, that are still living in the past, man. The thing is, if you continue thinking that way, the world is just gonna become worse. Yo, what the hell are we still doing this for? My hand, Shane. She looked in my eyes and trusted me. I think she's still alive, and I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna write her off. Oh God, yeah. Oh, the Shane. Like Shane is like a very decent. If in today's world, be very decent politician. Actually, looks after his people. Not Shane, Rick. Sorry, Shane. On the other hand, would be those backstabbing. Uh, I was like, "What?" <laughs> yeah, my bad. I, I got the mixed stuff. I get your point. Yeah, though. Yeah, I get yeah. where you're going. If anyone's gonna find her, it's gonna be Daryl. Sophia. How did she end up here, bro? How did she? she days. End That's the thing the most any kid can survive without water. He's when a trooper. Oh my god. Yeah, the horse is gonna get shot. The horse is gonna notice that. It's gonna get shot. <laughs> Oh! oh God. Nah, they better not kill out there, bro. Oh! Oh my God! How did he survive that fall? Now he went from the other side. Oh! He's the Juba Cowboy. He's a walker. Merle, is that you, brother? Bro. <laughs> I forgot. I, for I left Merle in season one. Bro. Soon, man. You're pregnant. He can't tell anybody. Okay. Who's the baby daddy? Obviously, Shane for drama sake. Shane says my good intentions are making us weaker. That I can't make the hard decisions for the good of the group. They're all hard decisions. But maybe I'm holding on to a whiff. Shane's decision is going to be final once uh, Dow comes back. This way. You are making the best decisions you can with the information you have. I don't see soft in that. Yeah, I agree with that too. My dad wants to talk to you. The two things can be right at the same time. Mm. To be fair, there's only so many hours you can waste. Like... If they were not living here, they wouldn't be able to. No, afford. like for example, if they're doing this, if if Rick has the same mindset for like two years, then you'd be like, "What's wrong with you?" But it's, so it's still recent, it's bro. Still, still recent. fresh. Yeah. Give it the first two, three years, and you see. Only a only a certain people can but at switch the end like of the that. Day, if you're trying to build a community to survive in a, like a desolate future like this, you gotta have people that care about each other. No, but and every treat everyone like your family. The day, bro, every group needs a shame. Yeah. In, in, no, this, need, in this type of situation You need a balance Is what you need You can't have someone Oh god Bro what is this guy doing bro <laughs> Oh my god One of my horses is missing I was giving the impression You knew about that I did not And Jimmy You took him out today Did he also give you The impression of my consent No he said it outright I took the boy at his word Jimmy is 17 He's not my kin, but I am responsible. These things need to be cleared with me. It sounds like we need to work on our communication. What do you suggest? Keep it simple. I'll control my people. You control mm -hmm. yours. Are you really going to kill off the best character like this? Yo, that looking like... Nice. Merle. Oh, shit. Nah, it, it has... Don't pull that arrow out, it's a hallucination, bro. Your wound What's going on here? You taking a siesta or something? <laughs> no catch. Lying in the dirt like a used rubber. God, God damn. Very colorful use of uh, rubber there. Try like hell to find you, bro. Like hell you do. You split, man. Lit out first chance you got. We went back for you. Rick and I, we get right by you. This the same Rick that cuffed me to the rooftop in the first place. Forced me to cut off my own hand. You his bitch now? I ain't nobody's bitch. You're a joke, is what you are. Play an errand boy to a bunch of pansy asses, niggers, and hey, God yeah. hell. <laughs> you know, That's your boys, man. That's your boy. That's go Gory's boy. Yeah. Hallucination. Bro, this is what he'd actually say too, man. Yeah, 100% he said that. I got one news for you, son. One of these days, they're gonna scrape you off their heels like you was dog shit. Ain't that right, boy? Ain't nobody ever gonna care about you except me, little brother. Oh my days! 
<laughs> How is he that dead, bro? Like what? Oh shit. Where Yo. did they come from? Why are they down here? Oh, bro. Yo. You know I don't know what the sun is here? How did they get this deep down? No, why did, why was the zombie not eating like his flesh? His flesh. Let's go! Pop! That's character. Oh <laughs> shit! By far one of the most intelligent ones when it came to the zombie apocalypse. Oh, Using bow and arrow. Yes, sir. 100%, that's the way to go, man. He never took care of me. Talk a big game, but he was never there. Max, I remember in season one he mentioned that his dad was in jail and Daryl was off with some woman. Not Daryl. Merle was off with some woman. Or what? You gonna come up here and shut my mouth for me? Well, come on and do it. He's really using spite to get energy right now, man. Come on, come on, little buddy. <laughs> Damn. You're almost there, bro. See, you should use that as motivation, man. Yeah, you better, Ron. <laughs> Watch this. Lori and Carol are cooking dinner for us all tonight. That's the first I've heard of. Well, I didn't think it was that big a deal. Yeah, he's going a bit too far now. Like, relax. What's going on with you and the Asian boy? <laughs> <laughs> you know how I feel. Please don't make things harder than they need to be. To be honest, I, I understand where he's come from. If Glenn was a black, he'd be like, don't be chasing around that boy. Crazy. I don't think, yeah, I think he's said... Why would he said, say that? He's not racist yeah. at all, bro. Relax. This guy, man, takes shit Yo, too seriously, bro. Man, God. You can't even joke around with this guy anymore, bro. But all I'm saying was, I understand where this guy's come from, bro. Like, man, you just walk in here, the random people that you just allowed to live in your place, they're just randomly just in your kitchen, just doing shit so comfortably. In the end of the day, it's not that deep. Like it you is you told you let them stay here, bro. You can't be like moving weird, like after you let us stay here. You get me? No, he 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 let them temporarily stay there. Yeah, okay. Can we not make dinner in the house? Yeah, but he, he's trying to make this kind of. And it's not like they. Let's be honest. It's not like they've done it by themselves. They asked the. Yeah, true. You know I mean? That is true. They all but lived it, there. His own family didn't tell him. So I'm only asking because it's like all the women are acting really weird. And, and I read somewhere that when women spend a lot of time together, their cycles line up and they all get super crazy hormonal at the same time. I'm going to advise you. Never say that shit again. To keep that theory to yourself. <laughs> what is she doing? What the f... It's not a hawker. It's Daryl. It's Daryl, man. Oh! To be fair, all of them, man. Why did you eat a fucking squirrel? He looks like a fucking walker. Third time you pointed that thing on my head. You gonna pull the trigger or what? Oh my god! Yo. Oh, this show is just annoying, bro. What is wrong with Andrea, bro? What the bro? hell is wrong with these I'm people? with the this old man. Proving. Get the hell off my goddamn yard. What on earth is going on out here? Nah, Glenn was right, bro. All these girls are tripping. <laughs> Like, bro, like, this is ridiculous, bro. He found it. Found it washed up on a creek bed right there. She must have dropped a crossing or somewhere. You'd quit now? Daryl just risked his life to bring back the first hard evidence we've had. To be honest, I wouldn't be wanting my horses going out anytime soon. Why are they painting Shin out like some evil person, bro? Is he really asking that? Like, how, what do you mean? Like, he's literally been realistic. The here, guy bro. that wanted to shoot his friend? Is that the guy here? <laughs> That's completely different, bro. That's completely different. That's completely different. No, no, I can, I can tell us, bro. Like, he didn't, you're acting like he sh shot him. First of all, he graped him when it was sexual, so now he shot him when he didn't shoot him. Like, bro, you, you're like one of those people that just all in, bro. All in? Not everything is black and white, man. I apologize if I appear to be insensitive to the needs of others, but you see, I'll do whatever it takes to keep the two of you safe. My son and I are not your problem anymore. We're your excuse. Sons. Bruh. Oh, I told you, you. Only good pastime in this scenario. Bruh. Will her father say that? Did more for my little girl today than her own daddy ever did in his whole life. Do anything we ever say, you want to know. I know. We call these the big tree. They're all top one. Mm. We're, we're T-Dog's the best though. <laughs> <laughs> Said nobody ever. <laughs> 
Yeah, they did T Dog. Nah, bro, they need to. The next black characters they put in the show bro, better be very good. T and bro, T Dog. T Dog let the black we were, down, bro. The, we really got the dead <laughs> ass man. We literally got the best black character in episode one. About T-Dog, yeah, yeah you no, know, that's actually the character I liked, bro. That guy, where is he, man? He Malcolm. The dad, bro. Bro, he was a good character, bro. Something we don't know about these people, man. Carnivores. Imagine that shit, man. They eat humans. Cannibals. Cannibals. Yeah, sorry, cannibals. Cannibals. Everyone. Cannibals. I know what cannibals. <laughs> I just it's a slip of the tongue. Nah, bro. They eat this. They eat them, bro. Why is it? Why is it here? With all the f- like. I don't think it's sanitary to be eating them, bro. I'm pretty sure you definitely. I'm telling you, bro. The doctor found a They're way. They're rotting meat, bro. You were supposed to see this. <laughs> okay, I have huge questions. First of all. Do they? What the hell is? I'm not confused, bro. How do they capture that many walkers? There's no way they eat it though. I know, no but remember, Rick said that they deal with the walkers. They don't kill them. They probably just lock them up. Lock them up. Who? I don't see the point of eating them. This, I'm pretty sure you would die. How much you want to bet? How much you want to bet? How can you make it like normal to eat? Yo, you He's get bit. You fucking <laughs> turn into a walker. Like, why it's would like you a eat DNA, the meat? It's a DNA thing. It's it? like all that means is it hits your bloodstream when the bit bite yeah, you. The literally. infection goes that into your bloodstream. Doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I don't know. I don't have any information in regards to if they're like when the blood splatters on you. I think they. Someone mentioned if it gets in your eye, the mist. Yeah. It might turn into a walker because your your eyes have uh, they can pretty much absorb whatever liquid that's that hits you right there and then. Um, yeah, that's gonna be really weird. Like, well, um, yeah, I don't know. I, where I don't know where. Or? I don't know where that's going because she seemed like you weren't supposed to see that as weird thing to say. I don't understand what's going on there. I'm just gonna leave that. Not as, I don't know yeah, what's happening. No point. There's no point. I'm I'm dead ass, bro. I'm so tired of the whole story with the little girl, man. I just want that resolved. Yo, already, man, man, I think this is gonna be a running gag where I say I think this is the episode where they find the little girl, but I, <laughs> I completely understand where Shane's come from, man. It, Yo. They, before I understand what you guys were saying there, but there's a certain point like, come on, man, like we can't. Mom is kind of giving hope at this. Yeah, point. like it's taking too long, bro. Like, oh, you find one little clue. Okay, I think I think this is probably gonna happen. They're gonna give up on the girl, and then she's she's either dead permanently or someone found her. That's the two things. Because they would have finished off with her them finding her instead of the like the the bear stuff. Exactly. Animal. Yeah. So I'm hundred percent sure she's alive somewhere. But it's probably not anywhere close to where they found that uh, toy. Yeah. But I'm looking forward to the next episode. We're going to leave the video there, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell to stay tuned for more content like this. Remember, guys, Shane is right. Everything that Shane said in this episode is 100%, 100% facts. Shout out, look- to, shout out to Daryl, top one character, best character. The Chuba Cabra exists. I believe him. I believe in everything. Almost at him. That's what happened. Let's go. Yeah. And Merle, tough love. Even his, uh, even his uh, il- illusion is giving that tough love, bro. You know, it is yeah, guys, we need the video there. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell to see you for more content like this. But a modern nomad somewhere yeah. else.